take. Very appropriate. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Terry hype. Uh, DDD is absolute combo food. Yeah. Is, that's going to be a problem. So the whole thing here is um, Tank needs to literally live up to his name <laughs> and tank all these hits, find yeah. his openings, Ooh. and really – oh, yeah, I like, I like the inhale that's to helpful. get the projectiles back, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm assuming that uh, Nito's projectile is going to beat out Gordo because most things beat out Gordo, and it's really, really tragic mm. for DDD. But, uh, yeah, swallowing it and just spitting it back, you know, keeps, uh, keeps your stage control a little bit. You know, you don't mm. have to back up, which is kind of nice. You don't have to jump. And it's very quick. It's pretty hard to punish uh, when you actually absorb something. Yeah, I would uh, really like to see Tank um, get some edge guards. Right now, he's taking it really close to a neutral. Yeah. Maybe. But that, that's how I really feel like Tank is going to capitalize on getting the stocks off of Terry. Yeah. Now like we're, consistently. Now we're in trouble. Yeah. So oh. Gordo, Gordo does get beaten out by Terry's projectile. Rising that's, tackle. That's no. rough stuff. So he oh. might be able to live a little longer than. Yeah, power geyser. Once character. once he has that, once he has go, you always have to be wary jumping because yeah. power geyser covers so much range ahead of him. It's like, it's like he just carries high. Yeah, and a lot of people get scared when yeah. he has that, so they like panic jump, right? Yeah, you definitely have to stand your ground. Yeah. And, and just chill. Yeah. It's a, I think it's a lot easier to punish the uh, other version, right? I don't know the name of it. Sorry. Uh, What's his other go move? What? <laughs> You're talking about Buster Wolf? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, Buster Wolf is more like you want to get for like out of a out of links like out right. of his combos. But as far as like catching a jump punish, yeah, power guys. Nice but Gordo. nice Gordo. Even got an edge guard. And, yeah, taking and advantage of uh, yeah, taking advantage of Terry's mm -hmm. you know exploder recovery. Takes away the uh, <laughs> the meter too, so we're good to go for a little while. Actually manages to take a lead here. Wow, that is uh, proving very effective <laughs> for Tank so far. Oh, okay, he's just going to close out with the jab, jab, power dunk. I thought you would got to go for, like, some, you know, fancy jab lock on stream. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you missed the tech. But you, we're, we're playing for the consistency, you know. Get what works. Uh, misses the, the parry on the projectile, but actually isn't going to get punished for it. Ooh, Ooh he did he catch that double jump? He can. No. Oh, no, he didn't wait for the double jump. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, nice punch on the inhale. He's not going to die, but really cool. Yep. <laughs> Any opportunity where you take to use the... Later. Oh, wow. <laughs> he fell on top of him. <laughs> he just sat on him. <laughs> it's always funny when people don't, like, respect that move. Because yeah. you, like... You, you can just get out yeah, of there. Yeah, just like. get out of there. Don't try to hold shield on and get shield broken. Just, like, let him hit the ground. Watch out for the star splash. Yeah, like, it's so damage. hard to even punish it because of the stars. Yeah. So, yeah, tank take it. Yeah, here tank take it. Uh, Ooh. We'll probably seal it out, yeah. Power dunk so good. Yeah, it, when you're playing a character like DD2, it's rough to, you know, DI the jab yeah. to get out of the power yeah, dunk no, you're consistently. Getting hit. Yeah, you're, <laughs> you're definitely getting hit. I'm telling you, tank, it has to be a tank. Like, just, yeah. I'll eat these hits, but I'm going to live long enough to, you know, edge guard you or get the kill first. But oh, oh my god, Gordo. Even he the was rising. That's yeah, so he was sad. just trying to set up his Gordo, but yeah. Neo's like, I'm just going to power dunk over here. Oh, goes for a dash attack, kind of a Hail Mary attempt to, to get a kill there. Oh, nice. He needs this. He needs to capitalize super hard on this position. Oh, oh. no. DDD. <laughs> this is pretty tense. Luckily, okay, yeah, I'm glad he didn't jump in that situation. But right. he is making him scared of the go meter right now. You think he could get a forward tilt after uh, after a whiffed geyser? Oh, nah. He took what he could get there, but of course the play there would just go for a forward air to force Terry off stage even more. Right. Ooh, oh he parried! Wow. He could have done so much. And the jab kill? Never mind. <laughs> yeah. That works. Oh my god. Yo, nice respect, respect. Yeah. Like, yeah, Nito. I like that Terry's hype and all, but you, you gotta go you gotta go Ryu or yeah, Ken versus me, man. Gonna, gonna, it's not for Z Fly anymore, dude. Yeah. We, we, we tried Z Fly. Sorry, man. It was pretty close though. Maybe yeah, maybe he'll do it for Z Fly. Maybe he's just he's got a Yo, if he's really about the Z fly, no, okay. Uh, no, no. He's about winning. He's about winning. <laughs> serious, serious. But, you know, top tanks up a game. The, the characters are like slightly similar, just in a way like how you play neutral against them. So I mean, if Tank can do some of the same, you know, similar things, he might be it's good just, here. It's just Nito's much more yeah. uh, comp. Um, so much more experience for this character. Yeah, experience. And I guess that's. Uh, I was gonna say confident, but I guess both. Right. He has so many more of his combos 
uh, and kill setups dialed yeah, down with this yeah. character. I think kill setups are a big deal because he was comboing fine with Terry, but actually when it came to getting the kill, he looked he looked not lost, but he was kind of throwing things out that weren't safe, and that's what lost him the game. So yeah, just just being able to kill safely is going to be a big deal against Tank. Tank sticking true to his name though. <laughs> Gets the right. forward air. Oh. oh yeah, you can't you can't full hop over uh, over Ken. Yeah, he, it's the same kind of scenario as the power guys with Terry. Yep. If you know they're gonna just commit uh -oh. to jump, catch that. Sure you can. Oh yeah, I passed it this time. Yeah. Like all right, perfectly timed spot dodge. Nice. Oh. Oh, he got out. Nice. Oh, still in it though. All right, tank slowly starting to fall behind here. This is gonna be a lot of damage too. Misses the tech, but is unable to follow up. Yeah, and this kind of all started from tank's choice to just uh, throw Ken on stage instead of just th throwing him off and just focus on you know edge guarding. Honestly. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I just think Didi's like you know. Yeah, oh, yeah again, I was gonna say. Jumps. Yeah, his jump is so floaty too. Yeah, you kind of have to predict when the short you coming and maybe just do a neutral air dodge down. Oh, with the Gordo snipe, all right. But it's weird for DDDs, I think, because normally in that position they're kind of they feel like they're an advantage because their aerials are so fast and they can just like short hop again. So DDDs when they're when they're above you, they're they're not really used to having to air dodge down because their aerials are so good. So it's probably strange for Tank to have to adjust to a character who can just like shoot a fireball out of his fist and take your stock <laughs> when you're above him. Yeah, the, the threat of Shoryuken is always real. Even that's just a thing you can throw out outside of him racking up damage with yep. all like his combos too. Good out of shield, good yeah. combos, good kill move. Oh, he's swinging the F smash. Oh. He's, oh, no. he's swinging for the fences right now. Yeah, he, he wants is. to get this kill. He needs something. That interaction was wild. <laughs> yeah, he was like, I'm going to throw these Hadoukens and, and see if you try to jump over yeah. them to deal with them, and then I'll throw out the OP. It's like, yeah, Tank's in a position where he basically can't be above Nito for the rest of the game, <laughs> which is uh, pretty rough. Good forward tilt. I feel like in this in that situation, instead of trying to throw the Gordo, he should try to capitalize on the side B that Nito's inevitably oh. going to have to throw out in order to recover. But yeah, nice. yeah, yeah, that's like edge guarding can 101, man. Yeah. You, any way where you can use, or use uses double jump, uh, or at least use a side B early off stage, yeah. uh, you should you should go for it as Yo, DB. He's what? coming back. Uh oh, nope. he's not coming back. Uh, <laughs> that's rough. Uh, but yeah, I just I don't think the Gordo's really worth it in that scenario. Because yeah. if the quarter doesn't hit, he gets back to the ledge for free. But, I mean, if you position yourself in a way where you can react to the side B, which is, like, probably Ken's most punishable thing, especially off stage, uh, then uh, I think it'd be more beneficial. But Tank keeping it real close, man. It started to get scary there at the end. So, very doable for Tank. Um, Nito taking a little bit of a risk game one. Might come back to bite him. He'll uh, have to talk to ZFY about it afterwards. <laughs> but we'll see, man. It's gonna be hard for him. Hey, Tank. man, you did he did one for ZFly. That's you gotta true, appreciate that's true, it. That's true. That's true. Okay, let's see though. This is game three. Yeah. Go ahead. See, uh, Tank have to adapt a little bit more here. I see him going for the inhale a lot, but not really doing it in a situation where okay, yeah, well, like that, that like that, that. yeah, that where he one. is putting Neo in a position where he wants to shield. That's yeah. what makes the. Um, Man grab with the inhale so good. Oh my nice. god. Or just catching air dodges. Dude. Okay. Oh, focus, but well, nice. Hits the double the jab. Multi, yeah, the multi hit of the jab. Real good stuff. Shouldn't kill yet, but if he can land an up air, doesn't quite get it. Ooh. Down smash is actually kind of hard to find. Oh man, he drops yeah. shield, trying to. I think maybe shield grab that back air, Probably. and then. Yeah, Nino's like, I'm already pressing some more buttons. Sorry, shield, shield grab is much worse in this game. So many. Frames after you drop shield. Yeah, especially against uh, Re or Ken. Ken just, yeah. can just keep throwing out consistent hitboxes. It's really hard to shield grab this character. Yeah. Like, they have to throw a really unsafe aerial in order for you to actually get it. Oh, Ooh, I like the early. attempt. Yeah, yeah but it's a good idea, but. It's yeah. better to be early than late, though, because he got to keep his positioning, but Nito was able to turn it around. Might be able to get something out of this. See, again, I just don't, I don't know if the Gordo's worth it. Too. Oh, just nice. enough. Nice. 56%, not too bad. DDD's uh, combo capability is actually pretty good. He's been uh, racking up damage on Nito pretty consistently, too. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Oh. Nice air dodge out, though. Yeah. DDDs can definitely come back from that, so that's the best option he could have picked, probably. Catch the, yeah, he caught that roll. That auto turnaround for Ken is so good. <laughs> like, you want to roll from Wesley, get out of this, right, these tilts. Oh, I'm just going to hit you with anything, but. Or you can just get the trusty up tilt as well. Yeah. Oh, so much damage already. Starting to lap tank here in game three. Oh, again. I don't know if it poked or if he dropped, but. Either or. Yeah. <laughs> Widow's your shield so low that you want, either it shield pokes or you just want to get out of shield so you don't have to deal with the hitboxes mm -hmm. and then you just hit that shore you can too. Not gonna kill, but like he's just applying a lot of pressure on a tank yeah. while he already has a lead. Oh, okay. so close there with the forward air. That would have been huge, but now he might take a couple extra percent, might even die. Again, he's in a situation where he can't really be above uh, Nito for the rest of the game, or he's just going to get Shoryu'd. Can't jump. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Nito's just playing so, yeah, so Nito, safe. Yeah, Nito like, pretty much knows he's just locked up. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh not like that. <laughs> oh, man. If, if Nito intentionally wanted to aim the Gordo back,